Uh, Obi, first of all, uh, you know, how's your health? I see you got your hand wrapped now. Is everything uh, coming into play a little bit? Yeah, everything has been a uh, rough patch uh, the past couple weeks, but I uh, plan on getting better real soon, though. What uh, what percent would you say you're playing at now? Uh, I don't know. Uh, Are you close to 100 percent? Yeah, close to 100%. Um, I've just been out there just trying to do what I can do for the team. Uh, just defense, block shots, rebounds, just doing whatever I can. Jared, you came out shooting the uh, final three-point shot early on. Was that something that you were uh, constantly trying to do, or did it just come to you as part of the offense, or what? Uh, no, basically my teammates were looking for me. Uh, Daquan Miller, you know, I was supposed to say I'm going to be out there space the floor, you know, just get, my, uh, get open shots. You guys had only a lot 46 points, but were there times that you know you were letting them back into the game? I mean, were you pleased with your defense overall? Or uh, I think it was mostly our turnovers. We had a stretch where there was a lot of turnovers, and then we let them get easy baskets. I think that's what we uh, we uh, coach called timeout, and uh, we got that together. So. Did, did it feel a little bit like the other night where you guys kind of had some sluggish moments in the second half, and things didn't go real well? Yeah, it was. Uh, well, it was at that point in time and against SEMO too, but Coach just said finish off the game and that's all we could do. Overall, are you, are you happier team-wise with your effort tonight as opposed to against the SEMO game? Uh, yeah, most definitely. I feel like SEMO, we still came and fight, but we just let our ground down a little bit in the second half. Uh, this half, this game, uh, we put two halves together and uh, came out for a win. A tough USC team. How do you feel like the last couple of games have prepared you for a, you know, a big-time opponent like that? Oh, uh, you guys excited to go on the road and, and get this opponent? Yeah, we're excited to go on the road. Uh, I think this is a great opportunity for us. Uh, we're going to play a top 25 team, and uh, I think we still got some things to work on. But I feel like, you know, overall, I think we'll be ready when we get get to Vegas. And especially after this, how do you feel like the kind of the non-conference schedule has prepared you for the Valley? I know you haven't been through it before, but over you have. You know, where do you think this team is kind of fitting in and, and forming to be in the Valley? Oh, uh, I think it was going to be. A uh, great year for us, uh, Valley wise. Just uh, comparing from last year to this year, we just got. I feel like we got everything we need, all the bits and pieces, and we keep working, being a team, and being collective. We're gonna buy in.